Hi guys, this is me, Thriftastic Mom. Today I just want to do a little thrift store haul for you guys. Um, I don't have a whole lot to share, but I did pick up a few things. Y'all know I just randomly kind of run in to the thrift store that's closest to my home here. Picked up a few, um, got one thing from there. And I picked up a few things from Goodwill. Um, I actually went in Goodwill looking for a certain thing and I got it. And I got a few more goodies because, you know, you can hardly ever go in Goodwill and not get more than one thing. <laughs> but anyway, I wanted to share with you what I got. A lot of this stuff is pretty much like the same thing. Y'all know I've been getting in the pocket letters and things and sending. I send out mail from time to time. So, um... They had a bunch of paperwork and stickers and different things like that that I went through at Goodwill. And uh, the first thing I got was just this little simple notepad. It's like three notepads in one. And I only give like 54 cents for it. But it's got these just like tan looking pages all through it. The whole book is pretty much, you know, the same color pages. But I just picked that up cause just to have it for notes and stuff like that. And, you know, 54 cents. That's a pretty good bit of paper that I can use. So that's always good to have, like, laying around the computer or whatever. So I grabbed that. And then I grabbed this little pack here, and it was 54 cents. And this was 59 cents. Um, this is just uh, called flat cards, and every one of them is purple. It's just like a piece of cardstock. Love that color, and they had originally it was like a dollar thirty nine on them, but you can make cards and envelopes, things like that with them. So I picked them up. You know, since I'm getting into the pocket letter thing. Um, I'm starting to try to pick up little things like that that I can get a good deal on. I got some stickers here. They're Hello Kitty and Christmas theme. These actually came from the thrift store. They have a different they have a different tag on them. But they come from my uh, local thrift store up there. It looks like they might have originally came from Target because they got the dollar on them. But I thought they were cute. So I picked them up. 25 cents. You couldn't beat that. Next thing I got, this stuff here came from Goodwill too. This is like a... I know you see these a lot around different places. They're just like a scrapbook kit. The whole thing ain't here. It has been used, but it has some good stickers in it. It has all these like vacation time stickers in it which I thought was cool then it's just got a couple pieces of cute different paper in it there about four pieces of that so I went ahead and picked that up just to get the paper and and to get the stickers because it's always good to save that money when you can you know what I mean and it had this little cut out I thought that was cute and um I think I give a dollar fifty nine or something like that for that. Um, next thing I got was this piece of scrapbooking paper here. This is actually paid fifty nine cent for, it, but it's still got a pretty good bit of paper in it. I'd say it's it's over a half full of paper, and it's just got like bright colorful pages in it. It is a little bent, but it's got some really pretty pages like that in it. Flowery type pages and stuff. So I went ahead and got that. But the main reason I got it is because it has um, stickers and cutouts, you know, letter cutouts and things like that. And I was like, yes, I'm going to get that. And then here is a whole bunch of just like letter stickers here and all these are stickers so I got that I mean you know for 59 cents you can't beat it this is called the uh, it's for like 
kind of like a birthday thing. It's got punch outs, and paper stickers, yeah. Punch out papers and stickers for 59 cents. And you see how much was in it, so I got a good deal on that. Um, I don't have much room in my bathroom. I'm in here because it's still rainy outside. And this is like the brightest room in my house when the sun ain't out. I also got this. It's just a big scrapbook. It is in a, uh, like a cat or dog theme, but I don't really care about that. I gave a dollar fifty nine for it because these things are expensive in the stores, and you know if nothing else. I said I could put some like washi tape over here and change that just so it don't look like an animal thing. But I don't really care about that. I like picking these up pretty cheap just to put my you know like YouTube stuff, YouTube mail that I get. I keep all that stuff, and I'll put it in um, I'll put it in these scrapbooks and keep it. And I got one, which is um, almost full, so I wanted to go ahead and get this one since I could get it at a good price. So I picked that up, and I actually went in there for one of these. And I got it full, so I'm not going to open it. Y'all know what this is. And these things ain't real cheap either at the store, but I only give $1.54 for it. I put, like, my clear letter protectors in here, and I stuck my like stickers and things like that in it just to kind of keep them protected. And that way I can keep it zipped up, you know, and keep them from getting really messed up because, you know, I'm collecting different stickers and things like that. Um, Got to have somewhere to keep them. <laughs> Stuff, you know, you end up getting, end up kind of building up a, a good size collection of stuff. And then I just started, I mean, I'm just now working on my second pocket letter. And I've already got a good stack of stickers and papers and stuff like that. And you got to put that stuff somewhere. So right now, I'm just using that for the time being. And I may come up with something else later for a uh, little bit better organization. But anyway, um, next thing I got is this beautiful apron. And I just thought this was so pretty. Got a little pocket. I like that the neck actually has a button on it here so you can adjust the neck. It's got two other holes there to adjust the, ne the neck on it. And then the bottom of it's got this cute little trim. It's just really cute and bright and colorful. It's got like dragonflies on it. It's really pretty and I only give a dollar for it. Because I do wear, I got a solid black apron in there, but I do wear aprons a lot when I'm cooking. Just, you know, so I don't mess up my clothes. Because I'm really good at messing up my clothes. <laughs> so I picked that up for a dollar. I thought that was a really good deal. And it looks and feels brand new. And then the last thing I got actually didn't come from a thrift store. But um, I went to my church. And we have a building out back where we keep yard sale stuff. And I had actually donated some stuff, probably at the first of the year to them. And I got rid of this pocketbook here. <laughs> Y'all know what that means. <laughs> but I used to carry this all the time. And I decided, well, I'm just going to get rid of a bunch of my pocketbooks, you know. And I got rid of it. I donated it to the church with a bunch of other stuff. Well... It was just about two weeks ago. I was like, I wish I had that pocketbook back because I loved it because you could change out these scarves on it, which I actually put this scarf in it. It's like a Christmas themed scarf. And it's the right size and I don't know why I got rid of it. You know, sometimes you just do that. Good size to hold everything. And I thought I would love to have that pocketbook back. Because I don't see, they, I think they originally had them at Dollar General. And I don't never see these anymore. And I wanted it back. And then um, the man that has been selling the stuff at church um, had some TVs. So I took Chris up there so he could buy a TV from the church to put in his room. And then on my way out the door, I looked down and my pocketbook's laying there. 
right there at the door. And there it was, just pretty as you could please, on the top of the pile. I was like, that's my pocketbook I was wanting back. I didn't know. I figured they done sold that thing, you know. But um, it was laying there, so I got it. And um, I got to rebuy it, of course. <laughs> because I gave it away. It wasn't mine anymore. It's the church's, so I got to rebuy it because I'm going to pay... Well, Chris is paying him for the TV Sunday when I go to church. And uh, I got to pay him for the pocketbook because, you know, that's just that's just the right thing to do. I shouldn't have given it away to start with, you know, but I uh, wanted it back. So I'm going to give it. And I know he probably ain't going to charge me but 50 cent or a dollar for it. So I'm going to uh, give him that when I pay for Chris's TV um, at church. <laughs> But anyway, you know, I wanted it back, and I got it back, so now I can start picking up more, you know, cute little scarves to change it out. I always, when I used, I used this thing for a long time. I love changing out these scarves to either match my outfit or to match the season, like Christmas season, autumn, you know, whatever. And I just love that pocketbook, and I don't know, I don't know why I gave it away. Who knows? But... I got it back now, so that's the main thing. <laughs> so I was happy to see that. I was like, it's, it's weird that it was still there after all this time. It hadn't been bought. And um, I got it back. I'm so happy. <laughs> but anyway, that's everything that I got on my little thrift haul excursions this past uh, couple of days. I um, hope you enjoyed seeing what I got. I did get some really good deals. So if you like this video, y'all give me a big thumbs up and leave me some comments below. Let me know if you've got any really good deals this past week at the thrift store. And um, y'all subscribe to me if you're not subscribed. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.